beautiful one with my channel. Today I don't got no fucking backdrop. Today we raw dogging it. We here with the wall and the camera and the two lights and we just winging it, you feel me? Today I did this side part um, with this 5x5 HD closure, really giving frontal vibes. I got this fat ass swoop. This hair is 30 inches long and I'll go ahead and stand up and show you guys. I did dye this hair jet black, so if you want to see how I did that, um, I straightened the hair and I also installed it using the the boho liquid go. I finally figured it out, y'all. We thought it would never happen, but here we are making it happen. So if you're into that, you want you like what you see, stay tuned and keep watching. All I gotta say is, and you already know who it is. <laughs> Starting off with the hair separating about how many sections count them all for me? One, two, three, four, and it's five. So five different sections, and I'm gonna be using the Kiss Jet Black dye today. Now, do I recommend you using the Kiss Jet Black dye? No, not really, because it's not that permanent, and I um I it like rinsed out a lot. The only reason I used this Jet Black was because I had it lying around the house, and it's like do you, we can take a trip to the hair store. We can use this Kiss Jet Black dye, and <laughs> so I guess you see what I chose. So I'm just going to be saturating the entirety of the head and just making sure that you're saturating. That's the only way to get a nice, even dye job is with all the hair saturated. And so I'm just going to repeat this all over and just making sure that every single hair strand is coated. I'll be coming through. I'll be smearing it out. I'll be rubbing it in. I'll be doing all of that. I'm watching uh, <laughs> the Meal of Tequila Amanda Bynes documentary in the back. I love all that shit. Y'all got any commentary channels to, to recommend to me? I love when niggas just sit there and talk about shit that don't even matter. Yeah, I eat that shit up. So that's the Aunt Amanda Bynes going on in the background. I'll link that in the description box if y'all want. But I'm going to just keep dyeing this hair. And I should be finishing up soon. As for the frontal, I did make sure I put Vaseline on my lace. And that just ensures that no dye gets on the lace. And then I use the brush to get closer to the root. Um... And I just spread the dye on like normal to the ends of the head. But for the roots of it, I used the brush and just made sure that every strand was saturated. And like I said, there was Vaseline on the lace, so it was fine. Then I went ahead and um, started flat ironing it the next day. And I used the chase method. A lot of people was asking what my flat iron is. I have the Babyless Titanium Plates. I think this is a one and a half inch. And I love it. It's such a good flat iron. I mean, like, it's really such a good flat iron. And like I said, the dye did kind of rinse out a little bit, but it is giving jet black. Like, it did its job, but, like, I, I highly doubt that the dye will last, like, three more washes, you know? Real temporary type shit. So, yeah, so here's what the hair looks like. Let's get started installing. Mm, so lustrous, so shiny. We really just genuinely love to see it. Okay, so now that you saw to this point how I got this hair, I am excited to try to do this closure in a side part. I feel like I gotta pluck it a little more, but I'm gonna see what it looks like when I put it on my head. I am gonna try to use this liquid gold again. I'm gonna use my blow dryer. I'm gonna use a little bit. Like, I, I wanna like this so bad. So today, here I am to try to like it. Also, yeah, there's no backdrop. You know what? I don't give a fuck. I, I, that backs are a lot of work and eventually I don't want to back it up anymore. Like I just want like a nice little desk back there or something. So this is just whatever the fuck this is for now. At least the lighting is good and I look great. I forgot to spray a little bit of the even tinted lace spray in light warm brown or light medium brown. I think light warm brown, that's what it was. Now this is going to be like this for a little second. So I'm going to just go ahead and pin this out of my face so I don't get pissed off. So I'm thinking I just have to cut the lace off and then just slide my ear in between like the little slit right there. I did my eyeshadow. Can y'all tell I did my eyeshadow? Like I, I tried to be trying to be different today. That's what I tried to do. Um, yeah, I do need to pluck this a little bit, so I'm just gonna pluck a little bit more. Um, if you want to see how I pluck my wigs, go ahead and stay tuned for my OnlyFans. I'll be dropping my OnlyFans this month. So yeah, I'll be back when I'm done plucking and I'm ready to install again. Now that I've plucked it a little bit more. It's just a little bit more plugged. I don't want this to look too, like, over plugged. You know, it is a closure. Um, I choose, like, move it back over into a middle part or something. Like, I didn't want it to be, like, too inconvenienced, you know? So, we're just going to go ahead and cut this ear tab out now. That's not a ear tab. We're just making it one because we're ingenuity like that. I am going to start putting on some layers of this liquid gold on my hair. And you know I can't find no clip. You know I can't find no clip. There's a clip. Not a clip. 
So I'm just gonna go a thin layer of this little gold using a nozzle. And then now I'm just gonna blow dry it on cold and just let it get dry and then I'm gonna do another layer. So now it's a little tacky, so I'm gonna go ahead and just put the wig down. Like I sang it to y'all, y'all ain't think I was gonna sing it to you like that, did you? And then now, I'm gonna just smooth it in. Blood drying again. I'm pretty sure this is dry, so we can start raising off the lace. And you know I didn't know my eyebrow razor was, but then I found it and it was right here, so here it is. I'm so tired. I'm trying to look, I'm not tired, but I'm tired as shit. Boom! Giving side part. Giving side part. So liquid gold was not that bad. I don't know why I hated it so much. Maybe I just need to work with it in smaller doses. Maybe I can't do a whole frontal with it. Maybe my hair just needs to be in place so I can do it. But um, it happened this time. So I guess liquid gold is not terrible. We love an updated review, don't we? This is crazy. I'm so glad this worked out. Okay. That's pleasant. Now, we're gonna go ahead and spray some of this Gotta Be Flex Hold Spray just to make sure and confirm everything is melted in and we can move on to these baby hair. That's all dry. I'm gonna go in with my grip gel and... Um, oh, here, and, and this. I'm gonna go in with this. The, uh, you know what I be going in with, don't play. No, my little flat arm's not plugged in, but I'll plug it in. So my camera cut off, but I just did my sideburns off camera, but y'all know how to do my sideburns. If you be watching me, it ain't no secret how I get it done. So go watch another video. Now we're going to go ahead and hit the side swoop. I feel like it should be really easy because, am I not giving Aaliyah? Hold on. Did, did that give Aaliyah? I don't know what that was supposed to get. It was supposed to be dramatic. Okay, so now I'm just going to start hot combing. I'm going to start hot combing this like downwards so that I get like the direction of it going. And I don't want to get all of this because this is a closure wig, you feel me? It ain't nothing over here. So I need something to cover up the like, the swoop, you feel me? I'm going to spray some of this liquid fix spritz gel all on my fucking face. All on it. Yep. All, all over my face. Oh, I'm fucking up. Oh, I'm fucking up bad. So I finished my swoop. The swoop is done. She's looking cute. This is looking cute and you know what we missing you know we missing we missing a little a little flatness so i'm gonna hot comb this down a little bit and just hot comb into place a little bit we're gonna spray some more that's gotta be on top this jet black is really giving it's really giving okay so now i'm gonna put a little bit of concealer on the part bam i ain't even gonna blend that out yeah i am i lied I don't like it. Why would I say that? That's not even like me. Pretty much finished. I'm going to go put on my top and my outfit. I probably want to take my pictures and I'll come back. I might have a different lip on. It might be red. We'll see. So I'll be back. Let's see if I remember to do this transition. So this is the final look. I feel so pretty. Shout out to Beauty Forever for sending me this hair and sponsoring today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed and learned something. Please stay tuned for my OnlyFans link. It's dropping real soon. And you don't want to miss the content that's dropping on it. If you don't already, follow me on Instagram, Beauty Via Julia. And like this video and comment if you feel compelled, okay? Thanks so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Bye, beautiful.